Hi friends, today we are going to talk about something very useful that will help you and it, it reduces the number of entry in the keyboard and all those things. Okay, so what I'm talking about is to copy the text field from the header to the line. Okay, in an invoice. Okay, so I'm going to have P60. Everyone knows FB60. Okay, and here I give the company code. Okay, and here I have the vendor number. Okay, and I just put this one, two, three. I just put the amount. Okay, this is my TL account. Okay, and uh, I will just not enter any other thing. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'll go to the text field okay so here i have to give the value date because for this gl and here i'll just put plus plus that's the catch plus plus okay and here in the text it will say test copy in line okay. so i'll just press enter you see get copied automatically so this is the magic because this will help you in order to identify that particular invoice number because they was, this will have a separate line for each year so you can just hit plus plus and you can get it everything okay so that will be this will be very useful now the next question you will say okay how you can do it in miro okay in miro also you can do it okay so the me in miro the only difference is okay uh so in miro so suppose i am in miro and here i just put 113 only difference is you need to probably go from the details tab okay rather than this text step because this is related with vendors so so here so suppose i enter this and probably to stop me because i don't have a, um, this thing okay let's press gl account enter a text jurisdiction so I'll just enter a text jurisdiction and here uh, here you can enter and here i'm this gl is there so enter this okay it's not tax relevant this needs a value date okay where is the value date here uh, it's not showing somewhere i tried to find it's not probably entered here so, oops, so i think i saw something well nope. there was no value date here so so here here so but here also if you want to add anything so it is required in the value date okay but i cannot find the value date but here also so you have to go into the details tab and enter and once you have the value date and all those things populated uh, then it will show up okay so the same thing the only thing is it will be copied from the details tab and the other screen we have seen in fb60 is from the text here so that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and have a pretty.